Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's look, we're going to be doing this fluffy twist out using products that I recently purchased from Cream of Nature's Pure Honey line. I purchased their twisting cream, their hair mask, and their conditioner. So I'm starting off on freshly shampooed hair and I'm using their conditioner their dry moisturizing or moisturizing dry defense conditioner and first impressions I liked the smell it was um, subtle it was honey like and it was very very thick upon taking it out of the bottle I thought it was gonna be an easy application but I actually found it to have little to no slip at all it didn't go on as easily as I liked it other than the smell I would not rate this product very highly um, so we're not starting off on the best note um, It might work for I wouldn't even say it would work for looser textures because I'm not sure if Conditioners that are heavier would work for looser textures, but anyway I thought it was Maybe it would be nice if you added it to your deep conditioner if you were running out of your deep conditioner or if you wanted to thicken it up some but other than that I didn't really enjoy this product. I thought the smell and the packaging and the bottle was nice, but that was it. The product itself claims to have pure honey, um, coconut oil, and shea butter. And while those products or ingredients seem to work together on paper, I'm not sure it worked together in the bottle. And so I was looking at the ingredients like, um, yeah. So I would give this out of a 10, I would give this probably like a five or a six got like a good thick consistency to it a nice caramel color so I'm gonna put that on my hair right now I would say this product was a little bit better I would give it a 7 out of 10 um, I would just say to be very very heavy-handed with this product it smells exactly the same as the conditioner that light honey smell but it doesn't have enough slip in my opinion. So in order to get that nice, well-coated feeling and to be able to detangle somewhat, I would recommend completely dumping this product onto your hair like I did here. And I especially focused on the ends. So I figured, you know, let's put a plastic bag over this and see if the product works any better after some heat and after some time spent deep conditioning. And it was okay um, when I rinsed it out I proceeded to stretch my hair by braiding it and I just thought it was an okay situation honestly um, so my hair was soft enough to where I decided to style it the next day and I did already did one half of my head and now I'm going to go use the twisting cream on the other half of my head <music> I felt like I would like this product based on what I was seeing. It was very thick and it seemed like a product that would hold well with my styles. So I was excited to try it and it turned out to be one of the better products. I would give this one a solid 8.5 out of 10. In terms of hold, as you'll see later, it did hold my style and it had some definition, if not a good amount of definition, and it kept my hair very, very moisturized. So right now I'm just going to do what I do in all my twist outs. Um, I'm taking out the braids that I had before, detangling a little bit and putting on about a dime to quarter sized amount of the twisting cream and then um, detangling again with the comb and twisting it up.
I can say that I did enjoy the fact that I did not see much residue. I didn't use a lot of product as a heads up, but the product that I did use did not leave any white flakes when I was putting it in and taking down the hairstyle. So I really like that and the scent is not super strong like their Moroccan oil, Argan oil line. So this is also a good alternative to that line. This product is not very liquidy. It's very thick and I enjoy that because when products are super, super uh, loose or liquidy, I find that my hairstyles shrink up a lot more than I would like them to. And so I found that this product was good for styles that I wanted a little bit more volume and a little bit more stretch. So yeah, there's that alternative as well. So it's Sunday morning, time for church. Okay, so I'm taking down my twists and I'm doing my technique to where like the bigger twist, I don't take down all the way. I just kind of like, you know, fluff them apart. And then the smaller ones I completely take, take apart. But all in all, I really enjoyed this twisting cream. I think it's the best thing that I bought from this line. I, my hair was so moisturized and very well um, defined in the areas that I wanted it to be defined. So I would give that product or that, yeah, that product like a, I want to give it, did I already say a nine? I feel like a nine is boosting, but it did its, it did its job. For that price point, I feel like it did a good job. And I, if anything, I would recommend the twisting cream out of everything that I bought. I'm pretty sure the other things in the line will probably be on par with my recommendation. Um, it's a very affordable line, so I think you get what you pay for. But y'all, look at that definition. It's cute. Like, it's really cute. So, you know, get the twisting cream, definitely. Um, everything else, you can probably use whatever you have already. Um, but yeah, I'm really loving this twist out. I hope you guys found this review helpful i hope you you know are inspired to go get the products this is not sponsored these are my own opinions so yeah thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in my next one <laughs>